Hello dear fans. Why Stalin was idealized in the USSR. Many people in the modern world associate Joseph Vissarionovich Stalin with a person who made a huge contribution to the historical development of our state. His policy was filled with cruel canons and strict implementation of all decisions. Still, Stalin became a major figure in history, admired by many generations of people. Stalin was a very educated person. It is known that he was always striving to acquire new knowledge. During his life, he read thousands of books, collected the richest library. It was the books that contributed to the all-round improvement of Stalin and the development of important personal qualities in him, which he displayed in many political situations. He was able to rally the country in the fight against the fascist invaders during the Great Patriotic War. Stalin was a strategist who carefully selected military personnel responsible for the fate of the army and the fatherland. Such talented commanders as Zhukov, Rokossovsky, Konyev and many others were put in the highest posts by Stalin during the war years, and this helped to defeat the enemy. The image of Stalin became associated with victory, he was praised everywhere. The cult of the personality of the leader of the USSR began to grow along an ascending line, and citizens respectfully saluted their ruler, who led the country to the great victory. Stalin did not try to make concessions from the West. He in every possible way contributed to the development of the scientific and technical potential of the USSR in order to skillfully resist the Western countries. There is a known case when at a conference of the heads of the USSR, the USA, and Great Britain, the President of America announced that the development of the atomic bomb had been completed, and now America has a club against the Russian guys. To which Stalin reacted very coolly and calmly, as if this did not bother our country at all. But leaving the conference room, Stalin asked to speed up the process of developing the Soviet nuclear bomb in order to ensure parity with the United States. He was not afraid to implement his own ideas and the ideas of his entourage. Stalin was a rather brave man politically. Under him, the first nuclear weapons were developed, the atomic bomb of academician Kurchatov and the hydrogen bomb of Sakharov. Also during the Great Patriotic War, the idea of creating the strongest weapon, Katyusha, was embodied. For the first time, Katyushas were used in the battle near Orsha, which caused horror and fear of the Nazis before the growing power of the Soviet Union. He cruelly dealt with the enemies of the people. Under Stalin, there was a tough party dictatorship. All government officials performed their assigned duties, and those who tried to avoid their execution were sent to exile, prisons, and concentration camps. Of course, during the years of Stalin's rule, many innocent people were killed. These are, for example, people who passed through the processes, doctor's case, Leningradskoy business. Some of them were rehabilitated during the reign of Nikita Sergeyevich Khrushchev. Nevertheless, the strongest apparatus of state coercion ensured stability and law and order in society. Thanks for watching.